another video on this beautiful Sunday evening. Hey, if you love fragrances and you love positivity and you love smelling good, hey, this is the place to be. Now, if you're not a subscriber to my channel, make sure you please push that icon bell. Make sure you push all so when I upload my videos, you'll be the first to get a notification. Now, if you're not subscribed, it only takes one second of your time just to push that red subscribe button. Come show Mr. Bro some support and love to his channel, you guys. Now, let's get down to prayer. Prayer today is Genesis 3.15. Once again, Genesis 3.15. So, today, topic, review topic, I'm going to bring you guys 10 design... 10 designer fragrances that you must keep. So, again, 10 designer fragrance fragrances that you must keep. All right? Now, I'm not going to go down, get down to the note breakdowns. I'm just going to go through them. Uh, this felt like doing some content for you guys uh, since both of my teams are winning. Well, actually, my Niners won, and then my Celtics is playing right now. They're winning, so I'm just kind of stoked, and I wanted to bring you guys some content today. So anyway, the first one I bring to you guys is no other than Avent Garden Levine. Levine. Avent Garden Levine. Now this one right here, it, it's a weird, it's weird, but this used to be uh, on discounters for <laughs> like 10 bucks, 20 bucks, I mean. And uh, now they discontinue this and now it's up in price probably like 50 to, it runs about 50 to $100. This is 100 ml, so this is going close to $100, you guys. I haven't worn this yet. I haven't did no review on it, but um, I watched my boy, Big Big Business, and he reviewed this, and they were going for cheap on um, uh, Fragrance Buy Canada uh, for 50 bucks, and I ended up getting the I ended up getting the 100 ml of this one. I think they had the 50 ml was going cheap, so I ended up um, grabbing the 100 ml, so but anyway, this used to be like, um, I think a midnight in Paris. I don't know. It was it back, that came out the same time this one came out. So they, they both were like running like $20 a piece. Now they're up there in price. So anyway, this is the first one. Levine Garden. That's my first one I bring to you guys. Second one I bring to you guys is no other than Tom Ford Costa Azura. Yes. Tom Ford, Costa Azura. That's all I need. I, I really haven't did any reviews on this one either, but I will. Uh, this one, you know, Tom Ford should be niche, all of quality, but, you know, this is a designer fragrance. And, uh, and I've been hearing compliments about this one, too. So this is two, Tom Ford, Azura. Third one I bring to you guys is no other than Replica by the Fireplace. You know, everybody talks about this one. <laughs> Um, I do have a, a little Eastern fragrance that smells just like this one. So, um, replica by the fireplace, you might want to get your hands on. But like I said, if it's too much, you can always get the Middle Eastern one. I think I, I forgot the name of that one. Um, but um, it's it's a Middle Eastern fragrance. So, but anyway, uh, third is uh, replica um, by the fireplace is my third. Fourth one I bring to you guys is no other than haha, one million lucky you guys. Gotta have this one. Everybody should have this one in their collection. Um, what I'm I'm told that um, that this one is going to be discontinued as well as the prevailing. So I do have um, I did have one million lucky. I just didn't like it out of all of them, but I do have one million. This one and I have parfum and then I have prevé. So. Anyway, one million lucky, you guys, you must have, you must keep, so. Anyway, this one's discontinued, gonna be discontinued, not yet, but you might want to get your hands on it. Yeah, that's my fourth. Fifth one I bring to you guys, no other than one million parfum. Yes, this is the one, this is the 6.8 liter, it's filled up, uh, um, haven't did any review on it yet, um, but, man, it's a nice fragrance. Uh, it goes different, uh, a different route than the, the regular uh, One Million Lucky and One Million Parfum. It's, it's got a lot of floral notes in it. So anyway, my, my fifth is One Million Parfum. Sixth, I bring to you guys is no other than how Givenchy Gentleman 
boy day. Now, let me tell you, I had the parfum, I had the um, cologne, uh, but I got rid of those two, and I just decided to keep this one, Boise. I just like the Boise is better. It has more Irish, more Irish into this one. This was when this one blew my mind. I I sprayed all three on the napkin, and the next day I came in, I was like, oh my God, what is that smell? And it ended up being the Boise, so. I decided to go ahead and um, kept keep this one because I was gonna get rid of all four of them, but I ended up keeping it. So, gentlemen, Boise is my seventh, but it's six, it's six. So, seventh, I bring to you guys <clears throat> no other than Fahrenheit Dior. Dior Fahrenheit, I'm sorry, Parfum. Yes, this is the Parfum uh, version. Uh, like I said, this. You know, all, I had the uh, vintage Fahrenheit years ago with along with the green polo. Um, but, man, I wish I could still keep those. And But I got this one. I've been hearing, talking highly, t people have been talking highly in Fragcom about this one. And it's pretty pretty good. But like I said, I haven't, I haven't worn it yet. But it's still in my collection. I will be wearing it soon. Plus... I will be bringing content to you guys. So that's my seventh, you guys. Eighth, I'll bring to you guys is no other. La Home YSL Latence. Latence. So, Home YSL St. Laurent Latence. This one right here. Um, and I remember having this last year and still haven't done no review on it yet but yeah this is a pretty dark juice and you know it'd be good for winter so that's why i'm waiting i'm waiting to wear this on in winter time so anyway this is my eighth eighth fragrance ysl parfum my ninth one i bring to you guys and i'm wearing this one azaro most wanted if you like grandma fragrances this would be the one you want if you don't then you don't want don't get it if you don't if you don't feel that you like grandma then this is not the fragrance for you so anyway this is toffee note in it very very kind of sweet and but it's uh delicious it's a dessert in a bottle so anyway most wanted by zara is my ninth and last but least, you guys, this is the baby. Oh, I haven't haven't did the review on it, but I just got it in my collection. That is Prada. A tense. Yes, 3.4. Got this bottle. It's gonna be in my collection for a while, you guys. So this is supposed to be the beautiful soapy fragrance and I say in their line so it's supposed to be a very soapy clean refreshing crisp fragrance so you know, I've been hearing talks about this one too and I do I, sh I could have bought out more but I just bought 10 out and I do have Prada amber and then Prada Prada amber home and then Prada home regular so I have two of them. So this one right here is my 10th, you guys. So anyway, there's all my 10 designer fragrances you must keep. I might, let me see. I must keep. Is it? Yeah, you must keep. And you must have in your collection if you have it. So that's my take, you guys. If you like my content, make sure you comment down below. If you know someone, 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 please bring them to my channel, share, subscribe. Last but least, hey, if you're out and about, be safe out there. Plus, um, I'm trying to get to my milestone, you guys. I thank you very much. I'm at a little bit over 800. Now I only got 200 more to go, you guys. Y'all can push me there. With you guys' help, y'all can y'all can get me to my milestone. As soon as I, I get there, as soon as I can give you guys a giveaway, a nice gift set. And I ain't going to tell you what it is, but I'm giving away a gift set. 
from my milestone. You guys push me to the limit. And hey, we're going to get this started. Okay? We're going to get this party started. Anyway, you guys, do me one more favor, too. Y'all be safe out there. Y'all have a beautiful Sunday evening. And do me one more favor. Put God first. Everything else will fall in place. You guys, y'all been wonderful. Have a blessed, wonderful day. Thank you.